So I want to go through how to use isometric holds as part of a strength um, mechanism for improving chin-ups. Um, if you've ever tried chin-up yourself, I'm sure you know there's a certain range of motion in the pull-up that you'll find most challenging. So you can directly target that range of motion by adding a hold um, just to reinforce that position so when you go back to a full pull-up, you've got range that you didn't have before, or strength in that range that you didn't have before. Um, so you need to set up from the top to start with. Um, so you'll know yourself where you'll feel weak in your chin up. So if you're not sure, you can just give them a try. So you get to the top of your chin up. I'm going to do the first one at the very, very top. So you get to the top, stiffen up, brace your abdominals, try and keep the legs dangling below. And you target about a 10 to 15 second hold at the top. You can also challenge pause open nights. You can challenge them at 90 degree holds. You can come down to about 110 degrees and hold and relax. So at any point in the range of motion, really, you can challenge that, that hold. I wouldn't necessarily suggest to go all the way down like we've just done. I'd go up, I'd find the elbow position that most suits you, hold there for 10-15 seconds, come back down and repeat that for steps.